Right open to level two. Open to level two. Good. Our level two friends and mommies and daddies watching. All right. <laughs> Our first word today is now. Oh, now we will have our spelling test. Now, hands out. Now, what? Out. Good. <laughs> nope. Now. Mm. Oop, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Good. I know what to spell now. Let's try it. Mm. Oh, good. Rosie's popping out her knuckle. Good. No. Next sound. No, it's Ow. Good. Rosie said it. Ow with ow o. Should have put stroke with the carpet. We'll make it touch the bottom baseline, Rosie. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Make it touch the bottom yeah. baseline. Yeah. All yeah. the way down and yeah. touch. And this one. All yeah. the way down and touch. And that one. It was just. All right. Yeah. Both Emmeline and Rosie. Who look down. Look down. Tell me what's right. Nice. So soon Rosie will say it. How do I mark this word, Emmeline? Good. Get your straight edge out. Make sure. Good. Ooh, did you know I was going to ask why? <laughs> we always underline double phonograms. Good job. Oh my goodness, this is tricky. This is tricky. Now it is time for our spelling test. Now. Ooh, when? When is our spelling test? In an hour? Did we already have our spelling test? When? Now is the time for our spelling test. Now, an adjective, article, verb. Emmeline? Pronoun, adverb. adverb. Oh. I knew it was going to be adverb, but I thought I would make it make sense. <laughs> yep. But it's when. Yeah, it tells us when, right? It adds to the verb and tells when. us when. when. Nice. It's an adverb. If I write in red. Good. Ooh, do you write in red, Emmeline? It's an adverb. Oh, good. She's going to write it in red. She's going to write it in red with me. Did you underline your double phonogram, Rosie? Yeah. Sad. Good. Not underline me double phonogram yet. Ooh, get your straight edge out. Underline it. Before you jump up to get a pretzel, remember to underline it, okay? Okay. <laughs> Our next word today is tray. Ooh, listen close to those sounds. Tray. I will put my lunch on the tray. Tray. Hands out. Tray. One. T er, eight. Good. T A T. Yeah, yeah, you know what it's good. Next sound. Good. Last sound. A of, of two. A two letter A that we do use at the end of English words. I knew we were gonna say that. Ooh, that's our magical sound. That's our magical sound. It's not magical. Oh, it's, it's our magical just, sound. It's not magical. magical. It's right magical. Sound. Baseline, it's not magical, yeah. Miss Kirsten. Magic. Oh, magic. Magic phonogram. Not a magical phonogram. <laughs> Never a magic phonogram. Look no down. Magic. Ooh, Rosie and Emmeline. Can you tell me what to write? Uh, a of A. Two letter A. Good. That we do use at the end of English words. Yeah. 
Well, I did too. Very good, Rosie. Nice. Ooh, Rosie, can you tell me how we mark this word? Good. Ooh, she knows. Get your straight edge out. Get your straight edge out. Mark it with me. Why, Rosie? Good. We always underline double phonograms. Nice. The tray had my dinner on it. Noun, adjective, article, verb. The tray. Emily? The noun. Had all my dinner on it. Yeah, why? Because you can touch your hand. Yeah. A noun is the name of a person, place, thing, or idea. Oh my goodness. It's a noun. If I write in red. You should write in red. <laughs> Tricky. Did you underline your double phonogram, Rosie? <gasps> nice. All right, here we go. Our last word today, level two, is she. Oh, she is a good friend. I could have said, oh, Rosie is a good friend. Or I could have said, Emmeline is a good friend, but I said she is a good friend. Oh my goodness, what is the, what is that when the, oh, I think it, Emmeline knows, when it takes the place of a noun, when it takes the place of a noun. Oh my goodness. Oh, we're going to ask that so soon. She, hands out. She, one, she. Sh of sh used at the beginning of wicka, a word wicka. at the end okay. of a syllable, but not Whoop. at the beginning of multiples after the first one, except for the ending ship. Yes! Oh, that Emmeline, she knows. Last F sound e. of e. F E. Oh, don't look at that chart. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know it was spelled that way because you looked at the chart? Mm -hmm. Nope, I ah, knew it. You tricky McGillicuddies. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Look down. Look down. <laughs> oh, Rosie, can you tell me what to write, Emmeline? Uh, Good. Nice. Oh, I heard both of them. Nice. Oh, I heard both of those friends. They both said it. Told me what to write. I just love that. I love that. It sure does melt my heart. How do we mark this word? Emmeline? Good. Underline your double phonogram, Rosie. Why? Good. Underline your double phonogram. And then what, Emmeline? What? Underline your E. Good. Why? Oh, my goodness. It's another rule. Oh, my goodness. Let's say it. The vowels A, E, I, O, and U. Oh, A, E, O, and U. Sorry, I said it wrong. Let's say it together again. A, E, O, and U usually say their names at the end of a syllable. Oh, is this the end of a syllable? Yeah. And it says its name. You're right. Good job. Ooh, now we're going to talk about the tricky part. I know. Oh, she is a good friend. Ooh, I could have said Emmeline is a good friend. I said she is a good friend. Now, an adjective article verb. I almost oh, out loud. Emmeline knows. Look at that girl. She's going to take off like a rocket ship because she knows. Emmeline? Pronoun. Oh my goodness. Look up here, Rosie. 
The pronoun takes the place of a noun. Oh, look at this. Look at this. There's our word. <gasps> she, I could have said her name. I could have said Emmeline is a good friend. I could have said, ooh, Rosie's name. I could have said Rosie is a good friend. But I said she. Ooh, it's a pronoun. If I ride in red. You should ride in red. Good. Ooh, Emmeline. Maybe. Emmeline's riding in red. Turn your books around. Turn 